Okay, we're here on a rather blustery day in Japan. And we're going to do a very special flight today. We are on Iwakuni Marine Corps Air Station. It's close to the Itsukushima Jinja no Otori, or the floating tori of Itsukushima Shinto Shrine. So, we are going to go there. The thing is, see, we got floats on. We're going to land there and stop. It's going to be our destination for today. So, going to get in, get going. We've got to get going before the sun sets so we can get in on time. So, it's going to be a very special flight. I'm going to have fun with this. Exploring the Japan update for real. Should have. I thought I did it before, but I guess not. So, set up and ready to go, so I will see you on the runway. Okay, we're here, so let's go ahead and do our run-up. The runway that is. So, that's out of the way. Strobe lights, landing lights, fuel pump on. You know, heat, go ahead and turn it on. It's kind of cold out there. Alright, that's dropped. Oh no. That was the wrong one to press, so let's try the running up again. So. Come off. One up. Okay, we're good. So, that was an embarrassing fault. Did not mean to do that. Correct runway, take off clearance VFR. Let's go quickly. Tower Mesa 547 at runway 2 ready for departure, departure to the north. Mesa 547 altimeter tree 0 decimal 0 6 wind tree 28 at 1 2. North departure approved. Cleared for takeoff runway 2. Okay. Acknowledge the clearance. Cleared for takeoff runway 2, Mesa 547. Part of that is wind, part of that might be my joystick noise. Part of that could be P factor. See, I'm not touching the joystick right now. The airplane is turning on its own. I'm just helping it right now. That's right, let's do it. The winds are out of the west today, so got to be really, really careful. Nope, 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 nope. She get off the ground. Oh boy, let's rotate. Okay, good. That was a tough one. Gear up. Check to make sure everything is good here. Good. Gears up. indicator here so we want to make sure our floats are actually Tsukushima is right in front of me so we're just gonna stay here so catch you guys there all right so this island right in front of us is Tsukushima Thank you. Iwakuni Tower Mesa 547 frequency change. So we're just going to leave it off. We're not going for flight following. Because we've got special permission to land at the shrine today. Itsukushima is right there. So, in order to execute this, we're going to need to start descending. 
plan is to pass by the Itsukushima Jinja no Otori. Otori. Actually, uh, two long vowels there. Turn around and then try to land in the bay that's there. Jinja. Right there is the Otori. So that's where we're gonna go. They're off of our right wing. There's the rest of the Jinja and there's the Tori. Right there. You can see it pretty good. That is right there. Just turn around and get in. Let's make a bit of a sweeping turn here. We're gonna go right for that bay. Can't really... If we mess up, it's gonna be um bit of a big deal. I don't really have any space to play with. So let's try to keep it between three and four hundred feet on this turn. moving extremely slowly especially for an aircraft and now we're headed straight for it so coming at an oblique angle put the flaps down the rest of the way how we can do this. We have a float plane so hopefully the sim registers us as a float plane. Water landings aren't as easy as they might look. Okay. There we go. Oh no. <laughs> that wasn't exactly a good water landing. <laughs> Can I put the gear out? Piers up for water landing. Piers up for water landing. That wasn't exactly a good water landing. That was tough. Like I said, it's not as easy as it looks. Let's see if we can coast back into the water. There it is, the Otori. Okay, well, that's better. That was, um, not a good water landing. At all. That's tough. Harder than I expected. Probably should have come in oblique and see if we could try to rudder our way around. Oh, we can do it. We're getting blown away by the wind, so like I don't have I don't know how to We just say we got stuck on the ground and then had to get towed back out to sea for that one. I have to figure out learn a bit more about how to use these uh amphibious planes. Let's get a shot.
see if we can get closer. I think I can. I think I can use my rudders to try to move around. Does it work that way? Can I do it? Can I rudder around? Doubt it. Wow, this is tough. So I can rudder that way, but the other way apparently I can't. Huh, interesting. Very interesting. Anyways, there it is. Take this picture for our thumbnail. Get one that's closer. So we can't slew. And we'll call that a day. Thank you for watching. That was our interesting flight. That was a bad water landing. I'll see you guys next time. And we need to land out further. I know because I don't know how to stop. But that's that. See you guys next time. And goodbye.